Okay, so we're going to be doing a supra uh, scapular nerve block from the anterior approach today. And we start from the supra uh, clavicular region. That's the supra clavicular region. You can see the brachial plexus on the lateral side. As I go upwards, the brachial plexus organizes itself into the interscalene appearance where you can see in the interscalene groove, we've got a three traffic lights surrounded by the scalene muscles. And in the bottom corner, you can see the beach chair appearance of the C7 vertebra. So that's the beach chair appearance. And the vertebral resins are in the extreme right lower end of the screen. As I go up, the C7 nerve root will dive into that area. And then this is the typical beach chair appearance, which C7 nerve root disappearing. As I go up further, now I can see the C6 vertebra with the anterior and the posterior tubercle. The anterior tubercle is quite prominent, as we all know. And the C6 nerve root is diving in now. That's gone in. If I go caudally, it comes out. If I go in again, it goes in. And the above nerve root is C5. And that's going now into the vertebra as we, vertebral uh, foramen as we see. So if we come out, we've identified this is a C5 nerve root. This is a C6 nerve root. We need to focus on these, follow them downwards till they join with each other. Uh, now that they've joined, this is the upper trunk. So I would expect the supra uh, scapular nerve to um, uh, ar to arise from the lateral border of this trunk. And if I keep my eye on this side, which is the lateral border over here, you can now see the nerve arising. If you can see that's over there. If I follow it further laterally, it will go and lie below the omohoid muscle, which is now uh, just above the nerve so if you know what i mean so if i go backwards you can see that's joined the upper trunk again it's rising 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 and now you can see it clearly lying below the omohyoid muscle if i tried really hard i could even follow it downwards i can still see it i'm not sure if you're able to appreciate it. it's right over here so so that's your suprascapular nerve again joining the upper trunk coming out and this fast scan will help you appreciate more. It's right over here. Now be careful. Sometimes there could be blood vessels in this area, which will give you a similar appearance. So always put the Doppler to check before you uh, start targeting and injecting that nerve. Thank you.